Hi, this is Dosbox Mom, and welcome back to Let's Play Secret of the Silver Blades. Yeah, off camera we finished rememorizing spells, uh, left the Well of Knowledge, took the teleporter back to town, and we've entered the training hall. Um, nobody's names had changed color in the party roster, but I thought I'd just check anyway. It looks like Elmo here did earn a promotion as a ranger. I know he was the one who looked like he was closest to earning promotion. I, apparently the names don't turn purple when they're ready for promotion in this game. Which is a shame. But, you know, you just visit the training hall each time you come back to town and I guess that would work too. So, let's go ahead and train. Eh! There we go. And we'll check everybody else. I don't think anybody else is ready for a promotion yet. No. Okay. Now he might be... able to memorize another druid spell or something, so we'll check on that. Yeah, and the usual be resolute on your path message from the training master. Now, supposedly this is the part of the game where you can potentially get attacked on the streets by black circle members, but so we did just save. So I'm gonna see if Elro here can memorize his new spells just camping out in the streets. Yeah, he's got one new druid spell coming to him. He's already got Fairy fire memorized. Oh. So we could either use detect magic or entangle or invisibility to animals. Yep, fairy fire is good for illuminating, you know, outlining invisible monsters. Oh. Maybe entangle. So we'll try that. And we'll try memorizing spells right here on the street. See if it works. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Red robe assassins drop upon you. Fire knives. What in the world are fire knives doing to New Vertigris? So, yeah, we're going to have to probably go inside the mayor's house or go inside one of the private residences. Uh, let's see how many hit points these guys have. 52. Yeah, I mean, they're a little more powerful than the fire knives we ran into in the previous game. Yeah, she doesn't really have anything. Yeah, she's got bless, but Okay, let's try a nice stinking cloud and then we'll just plan to stop in somebody's house and rest. Or in the mayor's house. Okay. All right. There's one chokes and gags. They've got 
some kind of poison or potion thing on their knives? Oh, great! Well, that would make it especially important to take them out quickly. Okay. Okay, Teresa, we could really use a whole person roundabout now. Yeah, she did manage to memorize whole person after we finished dealing with the dragons. Oh, you're kidding! Oh, crap. Okay, well, you know, the remaining fire and eyes are all in a nice straight line, so Elidan can just lightning bolt their sorry behinds. Oh, I didn't want that to happen. Okay, guys, <laughs> I'm going to pause the recording come back to this in a second. Um, we might still do this battle against the fire knives, but I'm going to make darn sure I don't get anybody poisoned, so hang on. We're back. You know, actually, since Sosita was just poisoned, we, could, we can use an, a neutralized poison on her to revive her. So, that, that'd work. Okay, anyway, we just cast Detect Magic on the Uber Fire Knives treasure, and they do have le magical leather armor. We'll have maybe Gimli pick that up. Well, I guess we'll have that ID too. Okay, let's go. Not there. Um, I think. Temple. Ah, it's the Lions of Courage! We have heard of your battle prowess. May we heal your pain? Yes. Let's see if they charge for healing. So, you know, I basically never used the temple before. Um, hang on a second. I've got a wind wolf here wanting to get to her food and water dishes. So hang on. Okay, we're back. Uh, you know, 99% of the time, if you make it back to town, you're able to camp freely, and between your cleric and your paladin, you can get everybody healed up. But, hey. Okay, let's see if he charges for a neutralized poison on... Hosita. Okay, she's no longer poisoned. And they don't have restoration or resurrection, but they can do a heal. And then a cure light wounds on top of that should work. Okay, well, hey, as long as it's free, let's get everybody else healed up. Okay. Okay, cure light wounds would be enough for her and for him. Normally I would not bother going to the temple as I as I just said, but Wanted to try it at least once.
especially since this is the one portion of the game where you can't camp freely in the streets. So, that's done. Strike every blow in glory, for our prayers go with you. Okay, and you leave. Okay, well... Well, let's go get our stuff ID'd, and then I think we'll go find a place to rest. Okay. Right now, there. Okay, it looks like the detect magic spell wore off. But I pretty much remember what the magic items were. Okay, so all that's leather armor plus two. So it's better than what Gimli had. So we'll go ahead and ready that. We'll sell off the non-magical longbow. We will not sell off any magical gear yet. Okay. Then let's get those bracers I need. So those are nicer bracers than what Ellen Ann had before. Let's trade the old ones to Gimli. Because I think there often comes a point when the bracers get good enough that they provide better armor protection than the armor does. Okay. And then let's check real quick to see if... Okay, he's currently armor class minus one. Let's see if it makes any difference to have the bracers equipped as well. Not particularly, but no need to unequip them just yet. Yeah, we still have quite a bit of the dragon's loot left. So we'll share that. And I think before we tackle Marcus's house, we'd better go find a quiet place to rest. Mayor's house is definitely safe. So... I'm going to encamp here. I'm going to pause the recording while I encamp and remember my spells, and then we're going to head to Marcus's house and either buy stuff or demand a few answers. So hang on. Okay, and we're back. Stopped very briefly by the pub and heard the latest rumor. Journal Entry 8 says, I didn't drink that much. I'm sure that mouse in the corner was glowing. Yeah, and this is one of those false tavern tales that's supposed to make you think, well, maybe Tyran Thraxus came back and possessed a mouse. He didn't, really. There's Tyran Thraxus does not appear in this game. Honest. Oh, there's more than one rumor today. Interesting. That old man south of the mayor's place could sure talk your ear off. Okay. 
Ooh, lots of rumors today. Wasn't expect so many gems down in that mine, no way to get at them. Life ain't fair. Oh, this is unusual. Journal entry 12. Oh, the old guy must ha be hanging out at the temple and we're hearing the tale about the temple again. Okay, let's just leave. And hang on, I think my dog has just decided to help my son take out the garbage. So I'm going to be back in a second. We'll head to Marcus's house. Hang on. Okay, and we're back, and we're just outside the residence of Marcus the Wizard. And, let's see, probably wouldn't hurt to cast a few protective spells. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, that won't help. Bless would help. Prayer. Okay, we've got like black circle lords that are going to be the next room if we don't leave. So basically 15th level fighters, I mean 13th level fighters, excuse me. Each equipped with plate plus one, shield plus one, longsword plus one. Right. Mirror image would help. Um, maybe haste. But nothing special to protect against spells, although fire shield, maybe. Hmm. Let me I might pass on fire shield for now. Oh, why do I have two haste spells memorized on her? That's crazy. I think I <laughs> memorized a haste spell when I meant to memorize a lightning bolt. <coughs> okay, well, let's hope that's enough. <coughs> and we'll save. And head in there. A fighter answers the door. Marcus is involved and cannot be disturbed. Might I interest you in trinkets? No. If there's nothing else, then I'll bid you good day. What do you do? Leave or stay? Let's stay. <coughs> More guards rush out into the corridor. Good adventures for peaceful folk. But desire our privacy. Please take your leave. Do you leave? Uh, no. I want to know if those fire knife assassins had anything to do with you. Okay, so here are one, two, three, six. There's probably one more black circle lord. Yeah, off there. So let's start whacking, wailing away at them. And I know I cast. Hey, surely it wouldn't have worn off yet. Let's try hold person.
Okay, let's try to hold initially the ones that haven't been wounded yet. Okay, we held one. Okay. Let's see if we can manage a fireball here. Okay. That's probably the best we're going to do. Okay, we'll try a fireball with her. Okay, we took one down. Yeah, that'll work. Okay, then... Try him first. Okay, him next. Okay, we'll start at this end this time. And I think these two are already held, so just that one. Well, you know, it's the other ones I would have liked to have held. Maybe Magic Missile. It's such confined quarters right now. Okay. Ah. Uh, no, she, oh, she's got one whole person left, but let's have her switch to her staff slug instead. Take out some of those guys that are already held. Okay. Okay, we got over 5,000 gold from that. And we'll go ahead and detect magic. Oh, yeah. All right, this is all plus one gear. Let's see who doesn't already have plate, at least plate plus one, among those who can wear 
plate mail. Okay, she's got banded plus two, which is basically same level of armor protection as plate plus one. So we don't really need to pick up the plate plus one other than for the gold value. Let's start with the long swords. And then check encumbrance when we're done. Because we've still got a couple of battles left before we finish clearing Marcus's house. And we want to make sure our movement allowance isn't hindered by carrying around a lot of junk. Okay. He is fine. She's fine. She's fine. He's fine. Uh, he's going to need to drop stuff. We'll have him drop those plate mails. Don't worry, there's plenty more where that came from. Right, and she's going to need to drop those plate nails. Yeah, that'll work. And then Pax can do her heal. So on Ellen Ann. And then we're going to encamp. We are not going to try resting, but we will try to heal up. And when we come back in the next episode, we will finish clearing Marcus's house. So we will see you then.